the inherent desire for heights and exploration has persisted over millennia. Two million years ago, our ancestors scaled the first ten meters of a tree without any tools. In the present era of swiftly evolving technology, the query arises: What heights? Have humans reached in their pursuit of exploration? Let's embark on a journey, starting at initial ten meters, to follow China's strides in the past year. At ten meters, the height of the Forbidden City walls and China's first suspended monorail, the Optic Valley Photon, which opened to the public on September 26, with suspended trains, unmanned operation. And a 270-degree panoramic view cabins, it offers the sci-fi experience of traveling in the sky with scenery flying beneath your feet. At a maximum height of 72.2 meters, sails the first domestically built large cruise ship, the Odora Magic Sea. It was named and delivered in Shanghai on November 4. After eight years of research and development. As well as five years of design and construction, the vessel is going to make its maiden commercial operation on the first day of 2024. Crossing the seas at 163 meters high stands the main tower of the Hong Kong Zhuhai Macau Bridge. On April 19th, the main part of the bridge passed completion review, making it the longest bridge in the Channel Sea crossing in the world. The 55-kilometer bridge links the Hong Kong Special Administrative Region, the city of Zhuhai in southern Guangdong Province, and the Macau Special Administrative Region. On December 15, group tours to cross the bridge started trial operation, venturing through mountains and rivers at the elevation of 4,410 meters. Chinese explorers seek to communicate with the cosmos. On May 10. The large, high-altitude air shower observatory in Daocheng City, Sichuan Province, passed the national acceptance procedures and commenced operations, ushering in a new era of cosmic ray exploration led by China. At 8,848.86 meters, the pinnacle of the world, the height of the Mount Chumulama represents the ultimate challenge in human exploration. On May 23. Thirteen members of the Chinese expedition team reached the summit, as they looked to carry out scientific research, including upgrading of a weather station, collecting of snow and ice samples, and drilling ice core. Beyond the Chumulama, at 12,100 meters, lies the maximum flight altitude of China's self-developed large passenger aircraft C919. On May 28. A C919 aircraft completed its first commercial flight from Shanghai to Beijing, marking its official entry into the civil aviation market. Gazing into the sky, human exploration of space knows no bounds. At a height of 400 kilometers, this is the operational altitude of the Tiangong Space Station. On October 29. On the momentous occasion of 20th anniversary of China's first manned space flight of the Shenzhou 5, China Space Station, also known as Tiangong, which means the Heavenly Palace, witnessed another historic moment in China's manned space history, as six taikonauts from two Shenzhou spaceflight mission crews conduct their space reunion. In the past 20 years. China has sent 20 taikonauts into space. Mars and Earth are closest at around 55 million kilometers, and the farthest at over 400 million kilometers. Communication with the Mars rover ranges from about 3 to 22 minutes. On April 24. The China National Space Administration and the Chinese Academy of Sciences jointly released the first global panoramic images of Mars, and also disclosed that 22 sites on Mars have been given Chinese names, such as Mohe and Zhou Zhuang. In this way, China's presence is permanently engraved on Mars' surface. This represents China's spirit of exploration. Taking unceasing steps towards the vast expanse of the universe.